Cancer, hello. My name is Kit. I'm here to do a reading for you. Who or what is coming towards you? And let's get to it. Spirit, who or what is coming towards Cancer, please? What does Cancer need to know? How y'all doing? I hope you're doing well. This is a timeless reading, so when you're drawn here, that's when you're meant to view it. We have the Page of Swords. Somebody's watching you. Ooh, Cancer. Somebody's watching you. All right, what do we have? The Wheel. The Eight of Swords and the Empress. Underneath the deck, we have the Knight of Pentacles. This is somebody who's been watching you, someone who sees that wherever you go, right? Wherever you go, the room lights up. They're in their head. They're in their head. I feel like they don't know whether they should approach you, whether they shouldn't approach you, because they really see you as the catch-all cancer. But, you know, they're taking their time because I feel like they're, they have a little bit of fear in them, right? With the wheel here, if they don't move forward quickly enough, I feel like the universe is gonna give them a little push, a little, right? Just a little push. All right, let's clarify these cards. Let's see what's going on. This page of swords, why is that here? What is that all about? They are watching you. It could be social media, it could be workplace. I don't know, let's see. Maybe we'll find out. Why the Page of Swords, please? There we go. <laughs> the King of Pentacles. All right, so now we went from the Knight to the King. So this, this person, you know, if you want to know who this is, this is someone who is very stable, is very mature, right? Um, someone could be like a boss, could be... Um, you know, something, someone older than you, perhaps. Wow. Okay. Give me another card, please. This page of swords. Who is this person? The death card. This person had an ending in their life as well, or not as well. You may have as well, but this person had an ending in their life. And, you know, they've been holding back for some time. I see that they do have a lot of love for you, though. They do want to come in and they do want to speak their truth to you. Question is, when and will they? One more card, please, for this page of swords. One more card, please. Okay. The Seven of Cups. This You have this person confused. Because I feel like this person doesn't really know if you're in a relationship, if you're not in a relationship. And, you know, this person is like, do they have other options? Are they, you know, do they want to even talk to me? Do they even want, you know, know who I am maybe for some of you? Do I want to invest my time in this person, right? Okay, this wheel, what is that all about? Why is the wheel here? Thank you. Oh, Cancer. Oh, my goodness. The wheel, please. The Knight of Pentacles. He's back. He's back. This could be a long time coming, guys. This could be a long time coming for you guys. Someone coming in who, you know, seems to be smitten with you the way they are. And the Page of Pentacles. Okay. Stability, right? This guy could have, this guy or gal, pardon me, could have money. Could have money. King of Swords. King of Swords. And the Two of Pentacles. So what I want to say here is just a slight warning. Make sure this person is available, right? before you jump into anything. Ace of Pentacles underneath the deck. All right, this Eight of Swords, perhaps that's why they're feeling stuck. Maybe they're um, involved, or maybe they see you as involved. Take it as it resonates, right? 
All right, the fool. Oh, a new beginning, Cancer. And the four of cups. They don't know if you'll accept their offer. They don't know if you'll want to start something with them. Because again, this is you. This is you, the Empress. No gender, guys. It's the energy. The Empress wants for nothing. And I feel like with this person, whoever this person is, they feel like they may not be good enough. You know, they hold that star in their lantern with the hermit. He holds the star in his lantern. That star is his wish fulfillment. And I feel like he's going within to ask himself, do I want to go this route? The two of swords. Which route do I take? Which path do I take? They may see you as someone who's guarding your heart as well. But they do not want regret. They do not want regret. So, let's clarify this Empress here. This is you, people. This is how they see you. Thank you. Two of Wands. Do they reach out? Do they not? Do they take that, that route? You know, do they take that path? Oh my God, and now the Three of Wands. They really long for you. Whoever this person is, they see you as the catch-all. Thank you. The Nine of Wands. They see you as possibly guarded. They know you have a, um, what's the word? What are the words I'm trying to think of? You may have high expectations or maybe they feel you have high expectations and they're nervous about coming forward cancer whoever this is give me a couple more cards please spirit for cancer regarding this reading this one temperance so they're going to take their time they're going to take their time they're going to continue to wait and see. You may meet them at a party. You may meet them at a function, a wedding, whatever the case may be. Out and about, right? Just kind of bump into them, perhaps. That type of way. Whoever this person is. Let me get you a couple more cards. Spirit, what else do you have to tell Cancer, please, regarding this reading? What else does Cancer need to know, please? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, look at that. And we got a flyer. Let me go get it. Ooh, cancer. All right. Cancer. Oh, I just got goosebumps. Oh, my goodness. If you could see my arms, I just got goosebumps. Man holding a heart. And again, no gender, guys. Someone, I'm telling you, someone has their eye on you. Spirit is saying, be patient. Be patient. Take care of yourself. This is card 19, breaks down to 10, which means any type of struggle that you've been, you know, having or if you've been waiting for someone to reach out, it's going to happen soon. So, you know, after a 10 comes a 1, and the 1 is the new beginning, right? Oh my gosh, Cancer. So there you go. There's your reading. I love, love, love you guys. You know what to do. I'll talk to you later. Have a great day. Bye.